Connolly Medical Limited presents the National Physician of the Year Awards. The National Physician of the Year Awards recognizes both physicians and leaders in healthcare whose dedication, talents, and skills have improved the lives of thousands of people throughout the world. The awards recognize America's top doctors. Three awards for clinical excellence, two awards for lifetime achievement. In addition, Castle Connolly honors non-physicians for national health leadership. This is their stories, stories of inspiration, of leadership, the sacrifices, the rewards, the challenges, and their triumphs. This is the story of America's top doctors. And good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and especially a good evening, in fact, a great evening, to tonight's honorees. My congratulations on your selection for this distinguished honor. And I join John Castle in welcoming all of you to the third annual Castle Connolly National Physician of the Year Awards Dinner. We strongly believe this group of honorees represent all that we are trying to achieve in selecting physicians for our guides. Excellence, dedication, a commitment to their profession, to their patients, and to all mankind. And we are proud to recognize them, and in so doing, recognize also the excellence of thousands of physicians on our guides and in practice throughout the United States. I would like to thank all of you for participating in this very special event, and especially for joining us in recognizing the excellence represented by our honorees. Thank you. Good evening, and let me add my welcome to those of others to this very festive, celebratory, and important occasion. There is one characteristic that separates those who are really good physicians from those that are excellent. They must have knowledge, they must be industrious, they must have compassion, but they also must be innovative. Whether it's refining a diagnostic procedure, improving a medical device, seeing how a methodology can be applied to more and more successfully, how a drug can be made less toxic, less interactive, more efficacious. That sets apart those that we honor tonight for excellence in clinical medicine. Dr. Jacqueline Noonan has been caring for children with heart disease for over 50 years. During a time when there were few women doctors, Dr. Noonan emerged as one of the first female pediatric cardiologists. She observed that children with a rare heart defect often had a characteristic physical appearance with short stature, webbed neck, wide-spaced eyes, and low-set ears. She first described the syndrome in 1962, and subsequently it became known as Noonan's syndrome. In recent years, the genetic defects that cause Noonan's syndrome have been established, and with it, the ability to test, provide early intervention, and eventually to find a cure. Her groundbreaking work in pediatric cardiology has helped tens of thousands of children and their families throughout the world. That the patient heals himself uh, with help from the physician, hopefully, rather than, than harm. Um, and it's, it's uh, healing uh, involves physical healing, a lot of support and an emotional healing. And, um, and depending on, you know, your faith and things like that, that has a good deal to do with how your spirit helps heal your 
your, your body. She's a lifesaver for this community. Um, we, we recognize that she's world-renowned for her practice, but she's just Dr. D Dr. Noonan to us. She's just human as she can be, and sometimes when people draw attention to the fact that she's so famous, we just go, this is Dr. Noonan. I remember being nice and just not making a big deal out of everything about it. And she just talks to you like you're just one of her friends or family. And she doesn't talk to you like you're a doctor and like you're stupid and you don't know what she's talking about. I think mostly about her is how I can never ever uh, see more patients in regional clinics than she can when I go out there with her. She is uh, faster at uh, doing everything uh, all the time than anybody else. Uh, and, uh, and the other thing I think about with Jackie is uh, what a dyed in the wool UK uh, Wildcat basketball fan she is. So, so uh, we've uh, cut a couple things short just so Jackie could get back to watch the game. She is the role model um, for all the young physicians, but especially for young female physicians. And, uh, and she has reached uh, the highest positions to show it to the other young female doctors that there is no bar, there is no limit. They can achieve that, uh, whatever they dream about. She's wonderful. Uh, you know, she is obviously when you encounter her, I mean, she's full of life and full of energy. Um, and as a student interested in pediatric cardiology, she's such an inspiration, not only because of her accomplishments, but of, be, because of her teaching, because of her, um, it, you know, she welcomes students with open arms. This is very amazing. Um, Lynn has helped me out. Tremendously, a lot. She's a very good doctor. <laughs> I'd like to say thank you very much for helping me through all the years that I've needed her. With my heart, the way it is. Well, first of all, I want to thank. Castle Connolly for this great honor. I'm not sure I deserve it because I've had so much fun in my whole life doing what I've loved to do. And it hardly seems necessary to get rewarded for doing something that you've enjoyed so much. So I've been very honored by so many people and I just want to thank you again. Um, you know, I've had a, a great time and what's nice about the University of Kentucky that in my bonus years, which I prefer to, to retirement, I'm still able to do the things I like to do. See some patients, teach, have time to do a little thinking and writing. Thank you very much.